very important video topic for y'all today. So listen, the video topic is let them call you crazy. One day they're gonna call you a legend. Very important video topic. So listen, in this life, right, um, if you are an individual who wants to do something different with him or herself, if you are somebody who wants to do what others aren't willing to do, if you are trying to be great at something, you're trying to be successful, you're trying to be famous, my advice to you is go for it. Because in this life, right, society has conditioned the masses to live a mediocre life, have our average life. And I'm here to tell you this, you can achieve anything you want in this life if you work hard, dedicate, put time, effort, and energy, and you believe in yourself. 100% truth. A lot of people don't believe in themselves, right? So when you are an individual who actually believes in his or herself, um, those around you will start to say that you're crazy. Now, it's okay. That's the first step to achieving or accomplishing greatness in this life. When somebody says you're crazy for trying to maybe become a successful YouTuber, maybe a, a successful entrepreneur, uh, maybe you're trying to be an Instagram star, a rapper, you know, something that's phenomenal in this life, they're going to call you crazy now. The moment people start calling you crazy, that's how you know you're on the right path. Believe it or not, when people call you crazy, they are just intimidated by your potential. That's how I look at it, right? So it's okay if people are gonna say you're crazy or you're this or you're that. Let them call you that. But at the end of the day, right, you're not gonna regret following or chasing your dreams because in the end, those same people who called you crazy, guess what they're gonna say? You're a legend, you're a GOAT, or you're the GOAT. That's how this shit goes, man. In this life, you gotta go all out when it comes to what you want out of life, man. Anything is possible, nigga. We live in a universe. We are the universe in physical form. So that, that means we can do whatever we want as long as we work hard, dedicate, put time, effort, and energy into it, right? So let them call you crazy, G. In the long run, we're gonna see who's really crazy. That's how I look at it, because it's like when people have lived average for so long, they think that because they lived average like you, you are supposed to live average like them when that's not the case. Certain people who are here are destined for greatness. They have an anointing. They have uh, they have it within them to be successful, to become a millionaire. You get what I'm saying? So look, dude, in this life, right, let them call you crazy. Women, let these bitches call you crazy. They average hoes, right? You ain't trying to be average. You're trying to be your own boss. Any female who wants to be her own boss, I respect you 100%, and that's on the most high. You get what I'm saying? I love that shit. I love seeing independent women who are strong. Yes, women still need men, but an independent woman who is strong, that says a lot about that woman because in this life, right, a lot of bitches can't really be independent. A lot of bitches can't really build themselves up and be worth something. So if you are a woman trying to start a business, I salute you on that, and I, uh, I pray and hope you become successful. And you will if you just believe in yourself. So... Listen, let them call you crazy. If they don't believe in you, that's cool. If they want to call you crazy, that's cool. That's how you know you're on the right path. If you don't got people calling you crazy for whatever dreams you're trying to accomplish in this life, then that's it's probably that's not what it is. You probably ain't going to make it. But what I've come to realize is that whenever you strive for something greater or bigger than yourself, they're going to call you crazy because they are small-minded, they are uh, closed-minded, and they don't see that they can be great within themselves, but you believe in yourself, you know within yourself that you can achieve uh, great things in this life. So in this life, don't worry about people calling you crazy. Who gives a fuck? In the end, those same people be like, oh, he's crazy for thinking he can do that. He's crazy for thinking he can be successful. You know when you select few people in his life make it? That's limiting beliefs. Did you know that anyone can be successful if they really tried? If you really try to be successful, if you get out of that low-level thinking, if you understand and know how powerful you are as a spiritual being, you can do anything you want, bro. But remember, everything is mental. So if you can't accept greatness or your greatness in your mind, then you're not going to be great. So if you think you're a low-level motherfucker, then that's what it's going to be. That's what you're going to be, right? So everything is the mind. I'm going to say this shit again. One of the 12 universal laws is this. The law of mentalism states that the universe is mind. My bad. Everything is mental. Right? The universe is mental. All is the mind. So listen, everything starts up here. You got to know and accept who you are as a spirit. Understand that you are more than this body. Understand that you are a multi-dimensional being. Let me one pause. All right, I'm back. Like I was saying, bro, you are more than what you think. You are a multi-dimensional being. So that means... Aside from this physical form, there is other versions of yourself existing on other planes of existence. So you are here, but you're not here, bro. Know how powerful you are. Once you understand how powerful you are and you accept 
who you are as a spiritual being using a body, nigga, you can do anything you want to as long as you put your time, you set intentions, right? You work, you apply action, energy to it. You can do it, bro, right? But a lot of people don't believe and know who they are. So they can't achieve shit. They can't achieve or amount to anything great. My bad, last and final edit. But like I was saying, you gotta know who you are as a spiritual being, bro. You are a God. What does the abbreviation, I said abbreviation. Abbreviation of God means generator, operator, dispenser, right? Dispenser. So that means you have the ability to generate things, operate, maneuver, and dispense energy, right? You are an energetic being. Everything in this life is energy. This whole universe is energy. So if you learn to master time, you can master energy. So look. Let them call you crazy, dog. In the end, they're gonna be calling you a damn legend. So just do you. You know your potential, you know how powerful you are, you know you are a spirit using a body. You know and accept it that you are a multi-dimensional being, right? You know you are destined for greatness. It don't matter what a bitch think or know. <laughs> you know within yourself what you're capable of and that's all that matters. So look, let them call you crazy. When you make it, they gonna call you a legend. So look, I love you guys so much. Y'all stay tuned for more content. And yeah, bang, 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 gang.